Uh, how are you friends? Welcome everyone because you clicked at the right time and the most precise moment to enjoy this new video. Thank you for being here. Well, today we are going to do a jailbreak, right? We are going to do it on these devices, okay? Your devices are already updated with their latest versions of iOS that Apple released iOS 15.8.4 and iOS 16.7.11, right? These devices are already updated, right? And we are going to jailbreak these devices, right? What will we need for this? Well, we will need the devices to have internet and for your computer to also have internet. That is super important to have, right? And we will also need a USB cable from very good quality we will need it to perform this procedure right so i suggest you use a usb cable of very good quality right so uh, regarding the windows computer i recommend you use a device right uh, uh, from a good recognized brand like dell right that brand dell is very good for these procedures right and that it has an intel core i3 processor at least yes intel core i3 because if you use a computer that is uh, very old uh, it might give you problems with the usb ports right so uh, that's important for you to take into account right before carrying out these procedures right and well what are we going to need for this well we are going to need the frp file program that frp file program I will leave you with in the video's description in a link for you to download it and to do this we will need to decompress it oh and to decompress it we will put it in the folder where we downloaded it the password for the file I don't know why people always ask me and I always mention it in the videos and leave it in the video description yet they always ask that question the password for the file is FRP file that's the pa the password FRP file we extract it uh, yes what uh, here is the before you decompress the file I forgot I forgot to tell you that you have to deactivate what is you have to deactivate it the because if he, if you don't deactivate it it will delete all the files of the jailbreak program right so it's important that you delete those files right we are going to run the program as an administrator we say yes well uh let's wait for the program to finish opening okay we place the program over here and one important thing we are going to do right now is that we are going to connect our devices, right? We're going to do it at this moment. Yes, the program already, well, here, already uh, detected what is the do. Device, right? And one important thing is that you have to register the exit you copy the device's exit okay and you have to register it on the frp file page to perform this procedure all right you have to go all the way down and what you have to do is wait for what are uh 30 uh 30 seconds uh to register what is the the oh. device okay Let's do it right now. This works for iOS 15, iOS 16, iOS 17, iOS 18, right? With devices that have an A11 processor that can upgrade to iOS 18.4.1, which is the current version. He has indeed appeared, so we proceed with the registration and sets it, right? Perfect. So now once it's registered, we are going to uh, to click on fixed drivers. We are, we are going to click that button. 
This will help repair the drivers uh, for the USB ports that our Windows computer uses, right? That is super, super important that you have it on. Keep it in mind, right? Uh, before carrying out these procedures, uh, all set, it already repaired them. So now you have to click on start ready. The device will enter recovery mode. This is completely normal. Don't worry. Okay. If you are on an iPhone 6s, iPhone 6s Plus, and the first generation iPhone Special Edition. Press the power button and the volume down button yes, to uh, do the program countdown uh, to perform the jailbreak, right? The program will count down and you will release the keys. Now, one important thing, you have to pay attention to the sounds your Windows computer makes to know when to release the buttons so the jailbreak can be performed without any issue. You do not have to pay attention for identify those sounds, right? So I'm warning you so you know what might happen if, in case it doesn't um, succeed with the jailbreak. We are going to click on start, press the buttons, perfect. We release the power button. Release the button. of volume down the volume abajo uh, we wait if you have any problem or something I suggest you disconnect the USB port and reconnect it quickly in case you have any problem yes I think not there it goes we'll see All right, the, the procedure is being carried out. There was no need to. There's the, the polarizing screen. As I said, there was no need for us to quickly disconnect the USB cable from the, the device. Ready. Let's see if the Paleron icon appears on our device. Here is the Paleron icon. We click on that or rather it's better to close the tool, it's no longer necessary, but as you can see, here is the Palerin icon, right? Uh, we enter it, perfect, we select Cileo. Uh, uh, we click install Cileo, the necessary files are being downloaded, yes, now we're going to set a password, right? Let's write sudo. Sudo, we give it set. It's finishing configuring. Cileo is already installed. As you can see, we enter Cileo, select allow. We click here where it says accept. Perfect. Uh, there are some packages that we need to update we'll click here where it says update all we'll click on confirm ready all the apps are being installed this as i told you works for ios 15 ios 16 ios 17 ios 18 right and perfect it is already installed right so Let's do a small test. We will do a respring on our device. Go to options. We enter where it says utilities. And in utilities, we click on where it says restart springboard. Perfect, let's restart the springboard. We will see if the jailbreak is here and perfect. 
the jailbreak is still on the device right as you saw it was easy and simple to do it works on ios uh, here on this device it's system version and this is simple right this works up to ios 18.4.1 on devices with an a11 processor that can upgrade to that ios right well guys that's all for today see you take care until next time bye